Sorry. Okay. We're back. I just needed to plug Jazzy. Yeah, dude, Jazzy Circuit's sick. Mutant is a very cool guy. Yes. I hadn't met Mutant until we went to DTN, and I met him outside, and he knew who I was, and I was like, hey, man, how's it going? That's so like, sick. dude, it's awesome to meet you. I'm excited to see him at other events this year. Yeah, hell yeah, dude. Because, like, I know he was at Frosty, but I didn't really get to talk about him. Ethan's pretty comfortable in this matchup. Ethan kicks my teeth in frequently. You know, I, this. I, I see that, too, right? But, like, he talks like he doesn't like it, this matchup. But I think he's just got it, it in his I head mean, that it's supposed to be hard for point, him. At one point, I had to, like, message Frankie and be like, Frankie, I need your help. I'm getting fucked by Yuri. Yeah. Like, I, it gave me a different appreciation for, like, how Yurian has to play, and that's helped me, like, understand it better. Yeah, yeah. But it's still, like, it's a tough matchup for both. And honestly, dude, it's just going to come down to uh, experience for all of us. You just, you just got to get hella matches in, dude. Well, and, like, if you don't know what you can do as Ken, it's hard to win this match. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, Ethan will talk some shit like he doesn't know what's going on, but he he puts in just as much work as like any of us. You yeah. two, you two are putting in the work, the most work. You, fucking Ethan and Wade, dude, are putting in hella work in this game, and it shows. Wade's work is like in secret though. Wade, yeah, he works the different hours than all of us, so yep. like all of a sudden you like hear that he's been on for like six hours in the middle of the night and you're like, oh, I see. He must be playing with those Japanese guys. For something, <laughs> right? Something. Something's gotta be, because dude, yo, yo, Ointment's in the chat. Shout out Ointment's, that's my dude. Yeah, that's the birthday boy. Yo, everybody look at the right, the top right of the screen. You see that dude in the white shirt? It's his birthday. I want everyone to say happy birthday to this man right now. Nope. Dude, why isn't anyone sitting in that? That's the chair right there. Shout out to movie chairs. Um, that was rough. He went for the option parry and didn't grab anything after. Oh, I, I missed it. But he didn't have meter and he was at an awkward range, so I don't think there was much he could have got. Yeah. Nice parry. Ooh. So like that's one of Ethan's favorite things to do is like fireball and he does an air fireball. He catches me every time because I'm an idiot. He does it every time too. Yeah. It's like well, he gets a really good option select off of it, so if he throws that and you get hit tackle. by the air fireball, yeah. he can tackle and then grab Aegis if he has a meter. Yep. And he, he's got that, like, solid. Yeah, he's got it on point, dude. Damn. See, but he's going for a sour spot, and that's not like him. He must like he has told me before that if you see him go for that, it's because he's nervous. Yeah, really? Yeah. He's, he's never told me that. That's sick. Because he knows like he knows all the setups. But he, he like wanted guaranteed damage. Yeah, yeah. Okay, there's the back though. But he doesn't. No, have no meter. So no meter. He can't really do anything. And this is the tricky part because like like right there. I mean, it got he him. Got it. He got the round, but, right? Like, yeah. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. But, like, look where he was at, meter-wise. He had, like, almost two. Sure. So, like... Yeah. Yep, best of five. Sacred ointment. Sacred ointment. I feel like that's a thing that, like... When I was a kid, I grew up Catholic. I feel like there was some sort of sacred ointment. I don't know what it is. Damn, okay. Shout out to Catholic. Shout out, yeah, I was about to say that too. <laughs> alright, alright. That right. was sick. Alright, so match legs up to looking looking really convincing, but still got no slouch. Let's see what he does to adjust here. Still got plays really good neutral and knows when to switch into offense mode. Yep. But like right now, okay, so now this is even, right? He's yep. got a mirror and Ken has a Ooh, that's okay. I like it though, right? Yeah, but it's you gonna... can't get out of there. That's see, that's tricky. It's deceptive, and it looks like you can jump out when the mirror's in the sweet spot. But you really should just chill and try and read the mix up. Yeah, yeah. Yo, Shouts is still down. Are you ready? For real? Yeah. He's okay. Yeah. Let's talk about how he's two down right now, and he's still like, look at him. He just won that round. Some people, man, they're, they're not that strong-willed. I know I'm not. I, I crack can. under pressure sometimes. I know you're talking about how long's it been 
Yeah. I think so he just got serious. Recently. This is this is what I know about Sildar. I started going to Paradise Arcade up in the Twin Cities, like about around the same time that I started playing Third Strike back in like August of 2017. Ooh, that was. And he sick. was up there grinding on arcade hardware. So I don't know how long he's been playing, but he's been around for at least two years. Okay. Shout out to Paradise. I yeah. Love order and stuff like Paradise is so good. Nice. Nice. That was solid. Oh, 100%. Yeah, it's not was, something you get overnight. Did, do you listen to No Frills? I do. Did you listen to Sanford Kelly? I didn't. That's the only one listen, I haven't listened to. Listen to Sanford Kelly because Sanford Kelly talks about composure and how important it is. Yeah. And when I was listening to it, I was thinking about like sometimes how I feel in matches and it was like, it's really good stuff. I'll definitely listen. I'll listen probably Monday. Sanford Kelly, Henry Sen, and the Arturo ones have been got. Bro, the Henry Sen one? Jesus Christ. I also Christ. listened to the DTM one. That guy's who, who name's that Andy. One? Oh, Andy? Okay. Yeah, yeah, City yeah. of Brass, right? Yep, City of Brass. Jeez, man. Yo! Wow. And see, that, Look takes, at that, shit. that takes, like, real patience, you because wait. I would have totally gone for the EXTP mm -hmm. there, but you can tell he plays against Ruben Crew and parry that You would have parried that shit, exactly. Fuck you up for it. Alright, guys. 2-1. Yo, we might see that. We might see that, carry. We might see a chunk. Well, we we might see the, the Mash Legs Big Bad Wolf run back. We don't know yet. This is looking crazy. If Ethan went and loses the next one, I think it's such a chunk. He play the chunk. You think so? He's, told, he's talked about it before. Man, I, I don't know. But I I don't know. I, I Maybe I'm wrong, but See, I, every time he talks about that, I tell him to not do that shit. I don't know. Because like, he's his muscle memory is not in that zone right now. And, you know, maybe I'm different, but maybe he can switch back and forth. But it's hard, dude. Still got going kind of wild here. No, he's, he's doing the right stuff. By maintaining that space and using standing heavy kick, it's really hard for, like, Urien to get launcher or to get, like, anything that can get him into the setup. Okay, okay. So, like, and standing heavy kick pushes back differently based on how far away you are from the opponent. So That like, I didn't know. Okay. Yeah. So, like, if you're very far away, it pushes further, but if you're close, it doesn't push as far. So, like, it's not a bad button on this. Okay, okay. At max range. If you're close, it's bad. Yeah, that's what I, and that's kind of what I thought I saw. It's like, he was kind of like, what's up? Yeah, you want to go there? That was sick. Shout out hydration. <laughs> Shout out water, dog. Yo, where's say hydrated by? Let's go. All right, we in here. Yo, yo, yo. So this is so that was really smart. He's staying out of the range where like he can get him an opening. Yeah. But like, ooh. Ooh, that was a sick parry. See, that was a. Oh my god! Wake oh my god. up, super. Just make him parry that shit. Yo, what? yo, yo! Shout out to DP. Yo, shout out to DP. Ken is a piece of shit. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Let's go, let's go. Still got, he's got a good smile. Yeah, he cracked a good smile. <laughs> yeah. He's having a good time. That's what I love, right? Ooh. Oh, that was right. That was right, because he would have got hit by the brain. Yeah, 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 yeah. Initially, I'm like, oh shit. But no. So he's, yeah, man. He's, he's doing the right stuff. Now he just needs, yeah. Chill. No, smart. That's Ooh. super smart. That's the only way out of there. Smart stuff. Mar he didn't quite have, like, the sweet spot uh, corner. Right? Dude, if Silgod was going for any of these doubles, he would have gotten so much additional damage. Oh my god. No, this is it. Uh, he didn't have here. Oh, Anti-air jab. Shit. So... Damn, 